Hey you guys, it's Nicole and I'm here with Sean. And um we're here we're here to do the boyfriend tag and this can be Vlogtober day twelve. I have a Leah over here in her crib, but let's hope she stays good throughout the video. Hi. <laughs> So, um, instead of doing the traditional boyfriend tag questions, um, Sean and I both were not a fan of the questions, so we decided to just ask you guys, um, what you guys wanted to ask us, and then we would answer them. In the um, the first question is from Heather Schwitkiss, and, um, her question is, where did you meet and this is for Sean. Were you skeptical of her baby since she had a kid? Where did we meet, baby? Online. Online. <laughs> Dude. Yep. Okay, so we met on uh, my yearbook. We were just friends texting each other, and then we got together. <laughs> so, and Heather, no, uh, I was not skeptical about her having a baby. Uh, I was a little nervous, haven't been around kids, but so far so good. I did have an ex-girlfriend who's pregnant, so I was already somewhat prepared for that. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, so this question's from Jesse Casey, and it's, how did you and Sean meet? Okay, so Sean and I met online, like we said before. We met on your, my yearbook. Um, we were just friends, texting, and then Dallas and I got together, back together, and then we broke up, and after him and I broke up, then... Um, Sean and I started talking again, and, um, after that, then we were just friends, hanging out all the time. He would longboard, um, how long did it take you to longboard to Like an hour and a half. Okay, so Leah wanted to be a part of the video. <laughs> after a while, we just started growing feelings for each other and got together. Um, this question's from Julie Drake Croft Jovovich. Jovovich, what things have you and Sean got in common? <laughs> what do we have in common? What do um, we have in common? Well, this looks bad. <laughs> this looks bad. <laughs> <laughs> um, Pursuing GD. Pursuing a GD, yeah. <laughs> You like biscuits and gravy, right? Biscuits and we gravy. We love biscuits and gravy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we also uh, don't like the cold. Yeah, don't yeah. like the cold. Uh -huh. Music. Music, yeah, we both like Eminem. Both mm -hmm. like Johnny Hobo. You introduced mm -hmm. me to Johnny Hobo. <laughs> this question's from Victoria Paul. Um, and it's moving in together slash marriage, more kids, etc. Hey, knock it off. That's not a question. So, I guess, I mean, moving in together. It's more like a to-do list. Yeah. <laughs> Ow! Ow! Do you see how far down I just cut my toenail? Yeah, then quit picking. I didn't mean to, it just sliced right quit off. Quit picking your fucking toes. <laughs> working on it. Yeah, we're working on it. We're <laughs> definitely saving up, trying to get our shit together. So, we're definitely working on it. We have only been together for almost, for about two and a half months, so we haven't really talked about marriage. <laughs> I mean, what do you have to say about it? Um, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't just run out and just get married, but, you know, it's a possibility. Yeah. I want more, I want kids. I don't yeah. have any myself. I'd like a boy and a girl. Yeah. Yeah, we were talking about it earlier, and, um... We, I'm on the Empanon, which is good for three years. Aliyah! She just said her name. So we were thinking that if by the time, like, three years comes around, then, um, and we're still together, we're still doing good, we're, um, you know, uh, in a stable life, pretty much, then, yeah, we would probably think about another kid, right? Right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, from Taylor Leanne Davis, um, favorite things about each other? My favorite things about you, like your hair. My I like hair. long hair. Yeah. This is my thing. 
I like your smile, especially because you're self-conscious about it. Oh, wow. It's beautiful. <laughs> you could tell my baby. I like uh, your optimism. My optimism. All right. My favorite things about you are I love your smile. Love you. you have a freaking sexy smile. Um, I like that you actually pull, like, go through with what you say you're going to do. Like, if you say you're going to fill out the paperwork for the Department of Labor, you actually do it and not put it off. Um... I like your different way of thinking, like you have a different and unique way of thinking about things. From Dusty Lynn Jacobson, does Sean want kids? If Dallas agreed, would he adopt Aaliyah in time if you stayed together? For one, he wouldn't have to agree. <laughs> right. Just saying. Just saying. <laughs> yeah, I mentioned earlier I do want kids. Yeah. From Lizzie Ruel, and I'm sorry if I pronounce your guys' names wrong, but yeah. So, um, that's the same question pretty much. Would he adopt her if, would he adopt her? And then a separate question, if you have a son, what is his name going to be and what are you doing for Halloween? So I chose see. Nathaniel. Yeah, he likes the name Nathaniel. Yep. I've always liked the name Carter. I was going to name Aaliyah Carter if she was a boy. That's not a bad one either, though. Yeah. Nathaniel Carter. Oh, there you go. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Nathaniel Carter. <laughs> Carter Lee. Well, that's done. <laughs> we... What are, what are we doing for Halloween? Still speculating. Yeah, we're still speculating on that. We don't know. <laughs> I want to be a monkey. Yeah, he wants to be a monkey for Halloween. Um, <laughs> obviously, from all the haters on my last video. Um, <laughs> hey, don't put stuff in your mouth. No. No. <laughs> but my main one that I really wanted to do was like an evil Snow White and then I wanted to make Aaliyah my evil dwarf but yeah I've still yet to come up with how I'm gonna do that costume from Wemmy Torbio Wemmy Torbio I actually got a letter from her <laughs> um I'm, I'm pretty sure I got a letter or a package it was a letter or a package First impression, any nicknames, describe each other in three words. Well, honestly, my first impression was um, that you looked pretty young, but I'd already seen your ID before then, so it wasn't, like, a big deal. But yeah. <laughs> my first impression was that, yeah, you looked way young. Yeah. And I wasn't too sure how that would really, oh, how the day was going to go. I felt a little out of my league. Really? Oh. I did. My first impression was... He looked very manly, he looked like a grown man, he was bald, and he had a gorgeous smile. This one. Smile. Yeah, that one. <laughs> 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 Any nicknames? Shit. I don't have any. <laughs> Poopykins. Poopykins, yeah, Shawneekins. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Those are our joking nicknames. No, they're serious. Describe each other in three words. Beautiful, smart, motivated. <laughs> and intelligent. Really, don't take this as a personal reflection. I'm just uh, scatterbrained. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sexy. Awesome. Huh? What? What'd you say? I said awesome. <laughs> just me. Intelligent, sexy, oh, I know, and hilarious. I love your sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> Wendy Victoria Kelly says, what was his exact first thought when Sean saw yeah, Aaliyah? Yeah. I thought she actually looked a lot like the Gerber baby. <laughs> Cuter than the Gerber baby. I, yeah. I don't know about the Ger Gerber baby. Julia Japinky, which is so cliche on YouTube. She's a YouTube mom. Um, she says, craziest thing you guys have done together, question mark. I was thinking Tarzan Land, but yeah. Tarzan Land, yeah, Tarzan Land was pretty crazy. I'd say it was crazier than Jump Creek. I don't know. Um, we went to this place, um, called Tarzan Land. Well, it's not really called Tarzan Land, but we call it Tarzan Land. And, um, it was really crazy. It was just, like, a bunch of, like, mosquitoes and cows, angry cows. 
Mm. Yeah, that that was pretty crazy. Yeah, those cows, those were cows they were pissed. They were like mm. pushing their hooves at us and shit, like they're gonna charge us. I was like, <gasps> oh yeah, my right. god! Just a little water bed yeah, separating us. Yeah, just like a little water bed separating us and the thousands the of cows. Off cows. Yeah. Corey Thompson says, how long were you guys together before Sean met Aaliyah? That day. Me, me, Aaliyah, and my cousin Mike went to go meet Sean. When you have another kid, what would the name be, be for a girl and boy? Sybil and Nathaniel. Yeah, he likes the name Sybil for a girl, and I like that name too. I think it's cute. <laughs> okay. Um, Kimberly Herman says, when did you and Sean meet? At the end of June. Yeah, it was June, at the end yeah. of June. Late June. Before the 4th. Yeah, it was like a couple weeks before the 4th of July. Amanda Jane says, What is Sean's favorite thing about you and about Aaliyah and yours of Sean? So what's your favorite thing My about Aaliyah? My favorite thing about Aaliyah... She's a hellion, but I guess my favorite thing... She's really cute. That is a plus, yeah. you know? Uh, by, by the door? She chucked it earlier. She chucked it? Yep. Yeah. I don't see it. Hey, uh. Nicole's not very good at finding things. Oh, hey, baby. Oh, hey. We're talking about... Oh, yeah, Aaliyah. Your favorite things about me. Okay, my favorite things about you? Where did he did that? I know. <laughs> Corey Thompson asks, Did Sean ever get a job, and are any of you guys going to go to college? This second, no, I do not have a job. I have had a job. Mm -hmm. um, and at this time in my life, no, I don't really want to go to college until I mature some more, because, mm -hmm. like, don't want to sit in no classroom. Mm. So. Yep. And I do plan on going to college after I get my GED. Shirley Rebecca Jane McDonald <laughs> says, What do you think of the ex? What do you think of the ex, Sean? And if you had a kid together, what would you name he Oh, we already answered that. Yeah, we already answered that. So I hope that's good enough for you. But um, yeah, what do you think of Dallas? Uh, I think he's a piece of shit. Um, I'm sorry you had to meet him, had to go through that, had to have a kid with him. Um, you know, she's precious, but I mean, whoa, he's a waste of life. I agree with that. I hope he sees this. I hope he sees this too. Just in case. <laughs> <laughs> Shirley Rebecca Jane McDonald also says you. Oh wait. Okay, I'll read this. Yeah, I'll out. read this just just because I want to. She said you did a good job with Sean Nicole. He seems like a great guy. So f haters and naysayers. As long as you're happy and Aaliyah is loved and taken care of, then that's all that matters most. I am so happy for you. You de deserve all the best, and I can see and tell how truly happy you are. God bless and much love from Nova Scotia, Canada. Canada. I don't know why I stumbled on the word Canada and not the one before, but my mind was trying to stumble on the words before. It just stumbled on the word Canada. <laughs> um, Jessica Jane says, "When are you with Sean? When you are with Sean, what do you do when you both want to smoke? Do you take turns going outside while the other stays with her? Do you leave her in a playpen if she's asleep and go out together?" Do you smoke in the house but not let the smoke get in her face or near her? I don't mean it in a hateful way. It's certainly not illegal to smoke even with her around. I'm just wondering what you guys do about smoke breaks. I used to smoke and I would find it hard to get outside in the cold late at night. Yeah, but yeah, we just bundle her up and bring her out with, there with us if we're smoking. Um, I We don't smoke in the house. Uh, we don't let anybody smoke in the house, like, around her. Like, if we're at Sean's house and I have a Leo over there, then um, if his friends come over, or if my friends come over, like Kendra and Corey, then um, we tell everybody they need to smoke outside. But if Aaliyah's not there, then we don't really care. Like, we let them smoke inside. And when we're here um, at my mom's house, then if we need to go smoke, we, we will, um, either A, put her in her jumper or put her in her, uh, exerciser and then go out and smoke real quick or we'll have somebody watch her while we go smoke. 
Jessica Janes also <laughs> says, does Sean have a job, which she already answered. Um, do you have a job? Does Sean have a diploma, GED, or degree? I do have a job. I work at a <clears throat> uh, cheap seats theater, movie theater. Do you want to answer yeah, that I, question? Yeah, I have my GED um, for a few years now. Jessica Janes also says, what does your family think of Sean? Like, each person's opinion, and what does his family think of you? Let's see. I can't really speak for Maggie. I know she did like him. I know she thought she he was funny, even though Sean doesn't really have too good of an opinion of Maggie because of what she's done. But Mike um, likes Sean. He thinks he's really cool. Yeah, so he uh, Mike definitely likes Sean. My aunt likes Sean. My mom loves Sean. She's so happy that I met him. Like, my mom really loves Sean, even though... She, I feel, has a hard way of showing it. I don't know if you feel that way, but... Okay, yeah, but my mom loves Sean, and my brother really likes Sean, too. He tells me, too, that he's glad I met you, I met you, so... Uh, you know, it's just me and my mom, but... Obviously, she likes you, bought you clothes for Leah and teething, you know? Yeah, no, she thinks you're really sweet, you know, and that's really cool, because, you know, we don't really talk about those kind of things, so... It's nice when she just kind of brings it up, you know? Mm-hmm. Does Sean watch your YouTube videos? I've seen a couple of them just uh, while she was editing or sitting around or even in a couple in the background. Mm -hmm. I'm yeah. good at that. Okay, Wemmy Toribio, Tor Toribio or something. Um, what are some of your ideas for how to keep a relationship strong over time? Communication. Yeah, definitely. Communication is key. Sean, what are your thoughts on marriage? Uh... I don't know, like, I, I I believe in it. I don't know, I would like to get married one day or another. Alright, Sean, what kind of dad do you want to be? Uh, real supportive. Uh, I want to be there. I, w I didn't have much of my dad growing up, you know, so you could imagine where this is going. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know, I really just want to be around. Mm hmm Keep everybody happy. Be like an interactive father? Yes, interactive. Mm hmm Good boys. Both. Does it bother you if your partner has friends of the opposite sex, and why? Yeah, um, just due to my past, I had um, a friend of mine sleep with my girlfriend at the time. Well, we split up a day, you know, so God forbid, you know. Yeah, but... God forbid you get any time to heal over that breakup. No, I mean, I'm not a weirdo about it, but, you know, it, he's, it he's... makes me uncomfortable. I mean, I guess if she was spending and extra amount of time with this person you know yeah messages here and there is mm -hmm. not a problem right. and it does like it makes me uncomfortable like knowing that like if he's like hanging out with like girls like all the time but um like he said like it's not a big deal if like you know here and there they just pop up or whatever like I'm not comfortable with him on a regular basis like every single day going to hang out with girlfriends but mm. you know like I don't yeah. care if it's like here and there both what is your happiest memory of your time together okay so happiest moment yeah happiest happiest memory memory yeah. memory together I can't really pinpoint my happiest moment with Sean but I know that um, there's a moment that I'll remember for probably ever <laughs> because um, it was just really romantic, it was really sweet, and it was pretty much, it was the night that Sean and I actually got together for the first time, like we, it was our first kiss, and um, it was at Jump Creek, which is like this gorgeous, gorgeous like waterfall, and there's like a bunch of cliffs everywhere and rocks, and it was like in the middle of the night and um like we were just hanging out on this rock and it was just him and I and we we're hanging out on this rock and our friends were over like on the other side of those of, of the rocks like there was like a barricade. Making shadow puppets. Yeah and they were making shadow puppets and these shadow puppets were just so huge on uh the, the, the rock rocks, wall yeah. yeah the rock wall and like um that was when Sean and I had our first kiss and I'd say that was probably the most romantic like Mark sweet agree. moment yeah to Tanya Sarah true Trudeau or Trudy or something I, I'm sorry if I put your name um what's a pet peeve of each other's and what's something you like about each other leaving lights on <laughs> 
was gonna say laundry, but I do the same thing. Yeah, so, so mm. clutter. Clutter, yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That is pretty bad, isn't it? My pet peeve of Sean's is what? Know that you cannot make a decision for the <laughs> life of you. <laughs> I swear to God, <laughs> every single time I ask this dude, what do you want to do? Uh, I don't know. You choose. You decide. <laughs> you do it. You do this. You make the decision. What do you want to eat? I don't know. You decide. Is that Where do you not go? the perfect boyfriend, though? I can't make all these decisions <laughs> by myself. <laughs> What is something you like about each other? Like, let's consider this as like something that we do, like without really <laughs> noticing that we do it. I like this cute little noises you make. Like what? Like it's like a squeak. Oh. Like a so <laughs> 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 I like your charm. You don't. You may not realize it, but you're a very charming person. Your people talk to you and they just like you. Like you're. Like, I'm never worried about introducing you to somebody and them not liking you because you're just such a likable person. <laughs> so, just in time for Aaliyah to be getting cranky. That is all the questions. Um, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys comment, like, subscribe, and request videos. Also, go like my Facebook fan page. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, bye guys.